right welcome back a uh, new set dropped today pretty stoked to do it i think the first deck uh we're gonna do is demir fairy see how that runs but before we get into it you find yourself coming back to the channel go ahead hit that subscribe button small deal for you but a huge deal for me it would be greatly appreciated but what we're gonna run is the sleep cursed fairy one mana for a 3-3 flying ward 2, but he enters with 3 stun counters, but you can pay 2 to untap him. Ego Drain. Target opponent reveals their hand. You choose a non-land card from it. They discard that card. If you don't control a fairy, exile a card from my hand. Fairy Dream Thief. Uh, one mana for a 1-1 one, one flying. Enters the battlefield. Surveil 1, but you can pay 3 uh, and exile it from your graveyard. Draw a card and lose a life. Fairy Fencing, a uh, target creature gets minus X, minus X until end of turn, but that creature gets an additional minus three, minus three until end of turn if you control a fairy as you cast the spell. Fairy Mastermind, the Picklock Prankster, you can uh, do the adventure, mill four cards, then put an instant sorcery or fairy card from among the mill cards to your hand, otherwise you can cast it as a 1-3 Flying Vigilant. Spell Stutter, counter target spell, unless its controller pays 2, plus an additional 1 for each fairy you control. Very annoying. Go for the Throat, destroy target non-artifact creature. Uh, Obera, Dreaming Duelist, Flash Flying, when another fairy enters the battlefield under your control, each opponent loses 1 life. Talion's Messenger, Flying 1-3, whenever you attack with 1 or more fairies, draw a card, then discard a card. When you discard a card this way, put a 1-1 counter on target fairy you control. Halo Forger, flying. When it enters the battlefield, you can pay X. When you do, you may uh, cast target instant or sorcery card with mana value X from your graveyard without paying its mana cost. If that spell would put into the graveyard, exile it instead. And Talion, the Kindly Lord. 3-4 uh, flying. When it enters the battlefield, choose a number between 1 and 10. Whenever an opponent casts a spell with mana value, power or toughness equal to the chosen number that player loses two life and you draw a card as far as lands you know basic utility Ottawara, takanuma but we're going to run the dark slick shores shipwreck marsh underground river and we're going to run one draineth ruins okay that's the deck pretty excited to see how it runs and what we're going to come up against so let's quit the chit chat and throw down some cards All right, Eve Lark. Okay. Hands okay. We'll drop the dream feet. Feet. We do not need that. Because we have all the mana we're ever going to need in our hand already, so... Right, playing some hopeful vigilant, pretty cool. Okay, now let's go ahead and mill. We'll just see if we're warm with a little dude, man. Ooh. Got a little human noble, but it totally looks like a frog. I guess because he's cursed. It makes sense. Alright. It's kind of weird. Hmm. up to looks like he's playing around with the new roll stuff i'm very so oh look at that little rat man's okay i like it okay north inquisitor also a good card Um, 
I'm gonna swing in for one. Although I think I'm gonna have to kill that knight pretty soon though. Nope, we gotta kill that. picture though. Great. El Snoring. Great. Well, we got the Forger so we can get rid of it. I think, right? That's the... Yeah. two lands and hands kind of not good waiting for the field wipe to wreck us <laughs> looks like our tally on finally lord's coming in a little bit clutch there coming in clutch again Actually, pretty fun. I don't know really what to kind of expect with the newer sets, so uh, I don't know. I'm pretty excited for it, but I figured I'd kind of throw out a little quick video while I start, you know, digging through the set and seeing things. But let me know if you guys are excited for this new set or not. But uh, I I actually have a couple of good ideas for decks, but I want to kind of flesh them out a little bit. But before uh, before that, you know, we still got midweek tomorrow, so I'll be doing some midweek. But uh, let me know what kind of decks you guys want to see, and I'll see about throwing them in there. But thank you guys for watching, and I need to quit saying but. Super early for me. Not really, you know, thinking very well. But... There it is again. Uh, thank you guys for watching, especially if you made it this far. I appreciate the hell out you. And as always, I'll catch you in the next one. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Because subscribing makes you feel good.